in this video I'll show you how I installed the iOS 26 on my iPhone 16 Pro Max and you could do this also you can go into general then software update and this is going to take some time until it's available for everyone but you can enable the beta updates or beta updates and then you can get the updated so now the iOS version is 18.5 iPhone 16 Pro Max when you install this uh, beta or beta software there might be small problems with them maybe some issues and it's a way to test the interface especially if you're a developer it's great to be able to try this before it goes available to everyone to all the iphone users the ios 26 is uh, the next ios version after 18.5 so they're skipping 19 going to 26 because it's going to be the year so iphone of the year 2026 will be ios 26 not 19. this is also good because all the devices in the apple ecosystem now will be 26 and 27 and so on so for beta updates i choose the option for ios 26 developer beta but you could choose for 18 also when there are new versions they should have more versions of 18 until 26 is ready so here is ready i enabled the option and i wanted to make sure that i show you that i'm actually charging my iphone while doing this even if the battery is uh, really high capacity and note the time is 21 22 so 9 22 when i was going to start now it says it takes a few minutes like under 10 minutes but it's really not uh, not that much it takes longer but uh, if you i believe if you charge the phone while you're doing this it's going to make it a little bit faster so it says now <laughs> nine minutes 21 20 let's say like that and it did take some time and some parts of this video they are on the higher speed but some parts I left them as they are just to show you what happens and not to panic. It's just a simple update. I mean, it's been tried a few times. Many people have done it. And if you want to try iOS 26, also this is, I have oh, 152 giga, 51 it is going down a little bit as it's downloading the update. But I moved all the photos and videos, almost all the photos, to the computer to the my pc and this is a way to also to reduce the space on the iphone and i also did a backup this is really important you do a backup in itunes or in icloud and in itunes with the password to make sure it saves all the keys and everything now it's ready the update was downloaded and this part is going to be out from your control you cannot cancel it here and you better have enough power on your iphone to finish this part this it will start a few times so you have the apple logo and the progress bar and then it starts again it looks like it's doing a restart but eventually you will get the ios 26 intro which is pretty pretty nice i like this i mean look at it this is glass they call it liquid glass and to be honest i didn't like it at first but i use it for one day now this has been one day most yeah i've been using it for one day and um i even tried to reduce the transparency there is an option you can reduce transparency and if you want to do that you could also do this but i really suggest you give it a try the effect is really amazing mm. that's this glassy effect don't know if i like it mm. let's see about this it really looks like glass especially the buttons they really look like grass mm. Did I say grass or glass? It looks like glass when you press the button and especially when you move things around on the interface, they look really like like it's a piece of glass in front of you and you're watching some, something behind it. This could be a great option. <laughs> like we finally get the sci-fi scenarios with the tablets made of glass or eyeglasses, the AR glasses. I like to choose the download only option i don't want to install automatically and yeah for the analytics i don't see an option to not to accept that and yeah now this is ready this is ios 26 installed 
Interesting colors. Mm. Looks like glass. Oh, this is weird. It's a bit strange. Your first impression might be that it's not good, especially the control center looks really transparent, but give it a try, you might like it. Thanks for watching.